Hi everyone, welcome back to Online Classroom Tekutio. In this video, we are going to look at the dispersion of light. Before we begin, I would like to bring your attention to the word dispersion. Dispersion means spread out. Okay, something is being dispersed, being spread out. When we direct white light into a glass prism, we will often see the spectrum of light coming out from the prism, meaning we can actually collect a rainbow. Why is that? This is because white light actually consists of seven components of color, the beautiful color of the rainbow in this order, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Every component of those color, they travel at a very different speed in a medium. That means red, orange, both of them travel at different speed in the glass prism. And also together with the rest of the component, they all have their own speed in the medium. Okay, so red light has the highest speed. It travels the fastest and hence it is refracted the least. If you remember refraction of light that we talked about in our previous video, if you forget, please go back and watch that video again, okay? So the red light is being refracted the least. It changed direction the least when it is in glass prism. And hence, when they leave the glass prism, red light is on top of the spectrum. And the violet light, however, travels the slowest. And so it is refracted the most. So at the spectrum out here, the one that's being spread out, you see that violet is at the bottom. Let's take a look at this more closely. Okay, so let's uh, start from where the white light is entering into a prism right here. Okay, so the white light is entering into the prism. It will be separated into its components of color, all seven of them. And different color bend towards, meaning that they change direction because of refraction, remember? They change direction because of refraction and they move closer to the normal line. But then they all move closer at a different angle and hence they are being spread out. And when the different colors leave the glass prism right here, okay, where the arrow indicated, they are refracted further away from the normal line. Okay, they are refracted further away from the normal line. And then they are dispersed or spread out in an order that is known as spectrum. This is called the spectrum. Okay, which is also the rainbow. Okay, the rainbow color. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Well, by now you would have guessed how is rainbow formed? through the dispersion of light. How did that happen though? When sunlight enters rain droplets in the sky, the rain droplets actually act just like the glass prism that we have looked at earlier. Okay, so normally we see rainbow after the rain. And the white light will be refracted and dispersed into seven different colors. That's how you get your beautiful colorful rainbow. Do you like rainbow? Jekutio loves the rainbow. Well, in your textbook, um, page 238, there's an activity, activity 8.7. When we all go back to school, uh, I'm quite sure your teacher will allow you to carry out this activity, where the first one is the dispersion of light by a glass prism, where we will use a ray box as our source of white light, direct it to a glass prism and you can catch the spectrum on the white screen right here. Okay, the detailed step-by-step uh, -step instructions, you can find it in your textbook again, page 238. Another activity on that page is the formation of rainbow where we will need a black cardboard and we need to make a little hole and attach it to our torchlight 
to be used as our source of light okay uh, just like the sunlight <laughs> and then we will have a basin fill it up um, maybe halfway uh, with water and then we will secure a mirror right here using the cellophane tape tape it down to secure it and when we direct our light you can catch the rainbow on a piece of white paper right here again if you need the step-by-step -step instruction uh, please refer to your textbook page 238 well that's all from Jekutyo in this video I shall see you in the coming video okay bye if you have learned something new from this video don't forget to like and subscribe